That one actually knocked me over. And now he's got something else to worry about, so let's uh, put another one down. We go deal with that. I'm actually going to pull out the, uh, the big hammer. So I can start sucking out their, uh, stamina. Get on the ground. Give me that delicious, delicious stamina. Hey, yeah, killed my own guy there, but we had ebony arrows. That's why it was hurt. Oh, and a bow. That's why it hurt so much. Yeah, we'll eat that now. Everything has to be locked down here, guys. You don't have to do. You don't have to do that to me. Damn it! There's only so many lockpicks in the world. I can't keep making them. Or can I? Can I make lockpicks? That's got to be in a mod or something. Oh, there's three. I broke three to get in there. I think. Maybe. Keep forgetting how to play this game. Alright, well. Didn't even notice that. Oh, hold on. <laughs> Look at that. Well, we're going to mine this and then fight whatever's inside. Stall Ream. I'm mean, going to guess there's like a Death Lord on the inside. Something silly like a bee. I don't know. Nothing, actually. No fighting that thing. That's pretty sweet, though. I wasn't expecting that. This isn't where I went. Oh, hey, look at you. That's going to hurt me. Oops. I was right. That's not very nice, man. I, I already took you out of there. That sucked. Where's my healing spells? Uh, might as well use them while I'm here. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H. Okay, it's not there. <laughs> Alright, magic. Uh, restoration. Oh, never mind. Let's close wounds. That is one of you. We are good to go. Oh, man. Oh, and that door back there, where'd that go? Oh. To a chest.
There you go. A diamond and nine gold. I guess that was worth it. Ah. This doesn't look good. Here, trigger whatever's down there. Okay. That's a big door of some sort. But we found him. Put that away. Okay, this is a Draugr. I thought it was a Falmer for a second. I saw this. Ebony shield. Take that. Just search Milius. Iron battle axe of embers. What's a Milius? I've got no idea. Mixture of Vigor. Satchel. Lockpick. Now you. Blood Skull Blade. Releases an energy blast with power attacks that deal 30 damage. That's pretty sweet. Take that. Ooh. It's a picture of a boat. Alright, received a letter of the e from the East Empire Company today. They say that some of the miners broke through the wall in a shaft of three in shaft three of Raven Rock Mine and found some ruins. I hope this isn't another waste of time like the fiasco they sent me to in Cyrodiil. I'll gather my assistant Milius and sail back to Raven Rock at first light. It'll be nice to see the old house in Soul's time again. Finally arrived in Raven Rock and was surprised at the number of dark elf refugees living in town. They really aren't from mining stock, but I think they'll make fine workers one day. Milius and I spent a good part of the day clearing off, clearing the ash off the roof of my house. The damn volcano is still erupting almost day and night. If it wasn't for the ash covering everything, it would be it would almost look beautiful. I ate the next day. Ooh. Yeah, he was a yawn. Wow. Milius and I are headed into Raven Rock. Mine to have... Mine... Raven Rock Mine to have a look at whatever it is the miners uncovered. I thought that was a new sentence after the K. K looks like the, it looks like there's a period at the end of that K. I think I'll stop by the old swing and scoop and pick up a few supplies before we head down. Couldn't hurt to be prepared. Looks like the miners broke right through the wall of an old Nordic barrow. I've seen this sort of thing in Skyrim before. Dan Nords have barrows dotting the landscape and almost none of them are ever marked on any maps. Looks like this is Looks like this barrel belonged to something called the Blood Skull Clan. I'm going to take some rubbings of the inscriptions on the tombs and see if I can can't learn some information, some more information from my history books. It's been a few days and I can't find even a single mention of this clan anywhere. Millius and I decide to proceed ahead. We've come to a drop-down point, but I can see a massive chamber below. It took the better part of a day to lower everything down and climb down the almost sheer drop. It's been an astonishing day of discovery. After exploring the large chamber beyond the drop-off, I was sorry to find the strangest weapon I've ever laid eyes upon, sitting on a pedestal of sorts. The blade appears to be flawless and is emitting a faint, chilling glow. Bits of parchment I found about the chamber seems to call this the Blood Skull Blade. Not certain if I should remove it yet, I think I'll sleep on it. I decided against my own better judgment to remove the Blood Skull Blade from its pedestal. Milia seems completely against it, but we need to bring this wondrous artifact with us when we find a way out of the barrow. I should have listened to Milius the moment the blade was lifted we were set upon by Draugr. Milius fought bravely, but he fell. I was able to destroy the remaining ones, but I was badly wounded. I can barely stand. My only chance would be finding a way out of this place, but I fear that I'm trapped. Fourteen? Question mark. Ooh, maybe the next day. Exploring has been slow. I can only move maybe a few minutes at a time before I have to rest. My supplies are running low, and I'm feeling weaker by the hour. The only progress I've made is finding a strange door with markings on it that I've never seen. There appears to be something to them I'm missing, as they've, conf they've confounded my attempts at getting through. I'll have to study this further in order to make any progress, barely can keep awake. Fairly certain that the key to the door involves the use of the Blood Skull Blade. When swinging the weapon, I'm noticing a ribbon of mystical energy emanating from it. 
I think by swimming the swing the the swinging the sword in different directions, it's possible to manipulate this ribbon and solve whatever puzzle this door presents. I hope to get well enough to put this to the test soon. Each swing is a huge effort. I've lost track of time. My strength is fading. I can't even stand anymore. My wounds refuse to heal. I'm done. I'm afraid this tomb will become my resting place. If anyone finds this journal, please send these notes to my superiors at the East Empire, Empire Company and tell my wife that I love her. May Arcade guide me to my final rest. Well, we found it. So I need... Well, someone's being roasted here. That's actually fairly recent, I would say, based on the, uh, the doneness of the person. So... We need to use the weapon. Turn this in, too. Uh, there we go. What am I doing here? That's the wrong, wrong thing. Okay, so... Got no idea what I'm supposed to be doing. Supposed to smack this? No. What am I supposed to do here? Okay, when I move away from the door, everything glows. I get closer to the door. Like the middle bit glows. Oh, I figured it out. All right. There we go. That's actually a pretty cool feature. I like this puzzle. Oh, I'm out of stamina. Maybe now. Sweet. Oh. And the door opens. To traps and shit. Alright, well. I've got enough health to hand just to handle this. Nice, nice try. Oh, you still got me anyway. <laughs> Take it. Take that. Okay. Oh. Oh. Well. Hell's that thing? Hold on. It's called a high seeker. All right. Time to sit up so I can fight Cthulhu here. All right. I've got my own nonsense to deal the to, to bring out. Here, you deal with that. I'm gonna deal with uh, whatever the hell you just spawned in here. Where is that thing? Oh, that sucked. Drop another one here. I'm I'm just swinging for the fences right now. 